In a news conference at Parliament House today, opposition leader Don Polye and his deputy Sam Basil said the move to suspend Chief Magistrate Neri Elia Kim is not an isolated issue. Mr. Polye believes it is connected to the fact that it was Elia Kim who signed the warrant for the arrest of the Prime Minister. Earlier today, in a statement, TIPNG pointed out the odd series of related events, including the sacking of an Attorney General and senior police officers and the cutting of task force sweeps funding. While the anti-corruption body admits that the chief magistrate is not above the law, it is calling on the Attorney General to think carefully before taking any action that could be seen as impinging upon the independence of the judiciary. In the meantime, Chief Secretary to Government Sir Manasupe Zurano refuted claims by social media that he suspended Chief Magistrate Elia Kim. He did, however, receive a detailed document from the magisterial services comprising of nine allegations against Elia Kim. Sir Manasupe also clarified that he had no authority to suspend her. He has gone through the complaints and has referred her to the office of the Attorney General. The Chief Secretary added that this has nothing to do with the Prime Minister or the events that are unfolding with him. He said it just so happened that this referral occurred at this time, coinciding with the unfolding of events that are currently before the courts. Deli Waigeno, National MTV News.